Hi, I'm Adam Truczyński and I'm director in Arstania. I dreamed of such a situation where nature and technology can coexist and create something new together. In the Durable Nature project, our goal was to tell a story through a hyper-realistic rendering in which the environment drove the narrative. To start the process, we looked at plants from the germination stage to full bloom. Our aim was to reflect this process as real as possible in CG, working in 3D Studio Max and Phoenix FD. Transparent water reacting with eyes on a dark background allowed us to focus on the action. Achieving the desired effect was not easy, but with Concept D it was possible and also comfortable. With such power within reach, we could not limit ourselves too much. For example, I could do R&D very quickly and start some simulation setups. I usually work in Arsene Studio. I like being close to the team. It's mainly not only about the technical aspects that is very important, but about the speed and quality of communication. Of course, time has shown that we are able to handle it remotely. We started the passion project in the office, but we had to move to our homes because of the coronavirus. It was a big challenge for us. After a few weeks, I started to appreciate this situation. At the beginning, I rigged 3D model with many bones. This allowed me to have full control over individual parts of the plant. When I create an animation, the responsiveness of the computer is essential. I need to see fluent smooth motion, so I don't have to render time-consuming previews. Finally, we had a chance to prepare every simulation in several versions and render every shot much bigger. In such a short time, it was amazing comfort. My role in this project was to support our director with shader development and final rendering for some of the shots. I've also been responsible for preparing 3D assets and rendering final back shot. I was able to develop the look of our assets in real time and render final back shot using GPU RTX technology in the comfort of my home. Ultimately, what we are left with is something more than just animation. Our intention was to give the viewer food for thought and reflection. If you don't know how to start, create whatever you feel best, but be careful with certain rules and then start breaking them.